I mean guys, after that debut, I think Zion is just destined for greatness. He just quieted all of the naysayers. He's going, shh, shh, you guys, you guys. Even after that first half, I'm sure there are people that are like, oh, I'm going to bed. This game's boring. Zion's disappointing. Blah, blah, blah. He's a bust. But that second half, that fourth quarter, let, let's go through the stats here. I'm just going to read them off my phone to double check because, you know, we don't want to disrespect Zion because, you know, he was getting disrespected tonight and I'm not going to take any Zion slander. So in 18 minutes, he had 22 points, 7 rebounds, 3 assists, he shot 8 of 11 from the field, and 4 of 4 from 3-point range. 4 of 4 from three-point range. You know, ESPN, they were kind of roasting him about his weight in the beginning. They put up that graphic that he's the third heaviest player in the NBA, and Zion's like, okay, okay, I see that. You know why? You know why I'm, I'm the third heaviest player? Oh, the, the two Splash Brothers are out this season, right? Clay and Steph? Oh, don't worry, Clay. Don't worry, Steph. I'll take it from here. Guess what? I'm both Splash Brothers in one. That's what Zion said tonight. I'm both Splash Brothers in one. I'll shoot four of four from the field in my debut. You know, the Spurs, they're going to disrespect me and let me shoot like that. ESPN, they're going to disrespect me like that. Some of these fans, some of these people on Twitter, they're going to disrespect me like that. Okay, just watch. Just watch. And that's what happened. Just an insane debut because it really, it didn't start off as much. Obviously, he's coming back from an injury. And even if he did end the game with, let's say, like five points or whatever, I wouldn't call him a bust or say it was disappointing. He just, he hasn't played in months. I mean, he's been out with a knee injury. Doing all that, they were reteaching him, what was it, how to walk, they said, I believe. Don't quote me on that exactly, but just moving around with his knee and everything. It was a lot. It was a lot. I mean, I wasn't down there, but I assume it was a lot. And being out of basketball for that long can't be easy. They even didn't play him towards the end of the game in that fourth quarter. I know the Pelicans fans were chanting, we want Zion, but I guess they wanted to restrict his minutes because it was his first game back. But in 18 minutes, if he could do that, just, oh, just think about what he can do when he's really fully back, when it isn't his first game back. I kind of wish the Pelicans did, you know, put him out there to finish that game because he really, he really got the Pelicans back in that game. Ultimately, they did lose, but I mean, the Smoothie Center, what is it called? The Smoothie Smoothie King Arena? What is it? Wait, I have to double check now. It's a funny name, Tro not Tropical Smoothie, what is it? The Smoothie King Center, that's what it's called. I mean, the Smoothie King Center would have just gone crazy if Zion led them to a comeback and they won that game. They were already going crazy for him, and I'm so happy for him because that crowd, like I said, was going nuts, and, you know, he's probably had to hear a lot of the noise that's been going on these past few months, and he's obviously a very good guy, so you just, you just got to be so happy for him. He's still a kid, and, you know, that was probably a long process, and to see him just come out and play like that, I'm sure everyone is just static and so happy unless you're a hater if you aren't then like get a life and don't hate on Zion because who doesn't like Zion and just wait you know wait wait for the dunks to come because if he shot four or four from three tonight these defenses they're gonna have to start strategizing better for him for him and yeah just crazy game so exciting how it literally went from here all the way to here in just a matter of minutes, how he ex just like exploded in the fourth quarter for a crazy performance. And yeah, I guess that's it for this video, guys. Let me know if you'd rather me do like highlight reactions. I didn't know what to do for this video. I decided to switch it up and just talk. But um, yeah, let me know what you guys like. Uh, make sure to drop a like, comment down below, and subscribe. Peace out.